Yo, what's good, everybody? Welcome back to A1 Hoop Zone. Back at y'all another one, man. But before we jump into this, make sure you hit that like button. Sub to the channel if you're new. Uh, if you want anything about these predictions, all they ask for is your participation. Hit that like button, sub to the channel. Uh, leave me a comment. Let me know if this is up for or not. If you want some off of it, man, that, that'll let me know. And we're going to continue to put separation and win-loss column on that prediction record, man. But nonetheless, let's dive into this. We got the 12 and 20 uh, Washington Wizards visiting the eight, uh, the gosh, what the um, 18 and 16, um, Utah Jazz. Good matchup here, man. Um, excited to see it. Unfortunately, the, the big news out of the, out of the whole situation as far as the injury perspective. Uh, Kristar Przingis is a game time decision, so he's questionable as of right now. Um, you know, so that's hit or, hit or miss with that kind of, he, he being obviously the, you know, missing piece as far as the big three for the Wizards. So obviously, Kristar Przingis, Kyle Kuzma, and Bradley Bill. Uh, but the good news is Roy Hachimaru is uh, he's going to be back uh, for tonight, making his return. Um, on the flip side of things for the Jazz, they're going to miss Kelly Olynyk and they're going to miss uh, Sexton as well, Colin Sexton. Uh, both big energy guys. Uh, Kelly Olynyk more so than anything. Stretch big, plays defense, flops all over the place. But hey, you know he 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 does his part in getting his team uh, the more more possessions of the ball. You know, obviously on the offensive end, he's a threat as well. Colin Sexton, any high energy guy, defensive end, that plays with a lot of intensity and tenacity. <laughs> if you haven't seen videos of him, man, definitely look that up and you'll see what I mean from from the intensity he plays with. But nonetheless, uh, for the most part, there, man, um, they're 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 kind of I wouldn't say even, but more so from a health standpoint, they got some big big guys out. But then uh, Mike Conley is back as well, so this is going to be a tough one to pick. Uh, very tough to pick, just because this Utah Jazz team, we all know they started off uh, red hot. They cooled off, and then they're starting to pick up some steam and momentum again. Um, again, I, I enjoy watching this team play. It's very, very up-tempo, uh, led by Jordan Clarkson uh, and obviously uh, Mike Conley as well. And then they have a bunch of people off the bench that can put it together in a hurry as well. Um, you know, one of the obviously one of the, the people that's revamped themselves and and definitely put it out there as, as a big that's to be reckoned in as well, man. Um, he's definitely been out there. Notice like Oh, hey, you know, I, I am a force to be reckoned with uh, when I'm out there on the court. Um, you got to keep an eye on him at all times. He can, he's a stretch big and he attacks the rim as well. So it's, again, it's a very tough matchup. But I was or am looking forward to the potential matchup between him and Porzingis. So I'm hoping Porzingis plays just because, again, they're both uh, stretch big and, and aggressive when it comes to attacking the rim. So we'll have to wait and see what happens with that. But nonetheless, let's get to the prediction, prediction side, man. Who are we going to pick for this one? I'm going with the Utah Jazz. Uh, I feel like they have more depth. Um, again, this Wizards team, uh, they're they're trying to get healthy. I like the team. I like the roster, but it just seems like they're they're struggling to get healthy from the Utah Jazz uh, perspective of things, man. Um, they're playing at home. Um, they've had some rest. They're going into a weekend where they'll get some more. So um, I, I'm expecting them to come out, play off and feed off the intensity and the crowd energy and, uh, you know, you walk away with the double on this one, man. So I'm going to rock up the Utah Jazz to win this one. And uh, that's all I got for y'all, man. So I appreciate you coming through. Make sure you hit that like button, sub to the channel if you're new. <clears throat> Excuse me. Leave a comment in the comment section, and I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of y'all. And if you wish to support the channel, uh, that information is scrolling at the bottom of the screen. It's also in the description of the video. Again, I appreciate you stopping through, and I'll catch you on another one, man. <laughs>